During the recent years, we have witnessed an ever-increasing economic conflict among different nations. Trade wars, restricting immigration, imposing tariffs and other trade barriers on imports, restricting foreign competition in domestic markets, and objection against open trade policies. Due to the ongoing disputes, focus has once again shifted to the domestic manufacturing capabilities in different nations. Leaders have already issued clarion calls to improve the manufacturing capability to increase jobs, reduce deficits, and decrease dependence on a foreign economy. So let's find out which are the countries which are leading in terms of manufacturing output before the COVID-19 pandemic started. At number 10, we have Russia with a manufacturing output of $222 billion, which represent 11% of national output and 1% of global manufacturing output. Russia exports product and services worth $353 billion. The most prominent industries include aerospace, defense, and automobiles. Russia is the second largest conventional arms exporter in the world. At number nine, we have United Kingdom with a manufacturing output of $243 billion, which represent 10% of national output and 2% of global manufacturing output. UK exports products and services worth $857 billion annually. The most prominent industries include aerospace, automobiles, and pharmaceuticals. 50% of all the vehicles manufactured in UK are exported. Roughly 2,000 companies are involved in the automotive sector. 18 out of the top 20 automotive suppliers are also located in the UK. It has also the second largest aerospace industry in the world. Roughly 90% of all the aerospace goods manufactured are exported. Although it is important to note that the success hinges on an open trade policy. Post Brexit, the future of these industries will likely experience some considerable turbulence. At number 8, we have France with a manufacturing output of $266 billion, which represents 16% of national output and 3% of global manufacturing output. France exports products and supplies worth $550 billion. The most prominent industries include aerospace, defense, and shipbuilding. France is the fourth largest arms exporter of the world. At number seven, we have Italy with a manufacturing output of $298 billion, which represent 16% of national output and 3% of global manufacturing output. Italy exports products and services worth $475 billion. The most prominent industries include automobiles and home appliances. At number six, we have India with a manufacturing output of $394 billion, which represent 16% of national output and 3% of global manufacturing output. India exports products and services worth $330 billion annually. The most important industries include automobile, pharmaceuticals, and textiles. India is the fifth largest manufacturer of automobiles in the world. India is also the third largest manufacturer of pharmaceuticals by volume. As per 2016 Global Manufacturers Competitiveness Index by Delight, India is projected to be among the five top manufacturing nations by 2020. Well, given the current conditions, India has to wait a little longer. At number five, we have South Korea with a manufacturing output of 416 billion US dollars, which represent 29% of national output and 4% of global manufacturing output. The prominent industries include shipbuilding, electronics, and automobiles. South Korea exports products and services worth $577 billion. South Korea dominates the shipbuilding industry globally with a 51% market share. South Korea is also the seventh largest automobile manufacturer in the world. 
Germany occupies the fourth position with a manufacturing output of $747 billion, which represents 23% of the national output and 7% of the global manufacturing output. Germany exports products and services worth $1.4 trillion annually. The most prominent industries include automobiles, machinery, chemicals, and electrical equipments. Germany is the fourth largest automobile manufacturer in the world. It is also the largest automobile exporter in the world. It is estimated that about 1,500 German companies position themselves among the top three in the respective segments they compete. Germany is the only member of the top five arms exporters who is not part of the United Nations Security Council. And now, the top three. Japan takes the third position with a manufacturing output of $1 trillion, representing 19% of domestic output and roughly 10% of global output. Japan exports products and services worth $700 billion. The most prominent industries include automobiles, semiconductors, electronics, and shipbuilding. Japan is the third largest automotive manufacturer in the world. Japan, alongside Germany, is renowned globally for the high-tech engineering equipments. At number two, well, you guess that, right? Yes, it is United States, with a manufacturing output of $2.1 trillion, representing 12% of national output and 18% of global manufacturing output. US exports products and services every year worth $1.6 trillion. The most prominent industries include aerospace and defense, automobiles, electronics, and steel. US is the second largest automobile manufacturer in the world. US is the largest aerospace and defense equipment manufacturer in the world. Till 2009, US was the leading manufacturer globally. After years of falling output, the manufacturing sector is enjoying a resurgence. US is home to some of the most high-tech manufacturing firms in the world. 3D printing, robotics, additive manufacturing, Internet of Things, and Big Data is revolutionizing the manufacturing sector in the United States. As per a report by Deloitte Global called the 2016 Manufacturer Competitiveness Report, the US is all set to replace China as the most competitive manufacturing country by year 2020. Well, 2020 is not going as predicted. Finally, number one. No surprises here. You already know the answer. Yes, it is China. With a manufacturing output of $3.8 trillion, representing 27% of national output and a staggering 30% of global manufacturing output. China exports products and services worth $2.4 trillion annually. Name any particular industry, the Chinese are already there. They manufacture anything to everything. China is the largest producer of steel, automobiles, electric cars and electronics. China has become the preferred destination for relocation of global manufacturing facilities. While the world is still struggling from corona pandemic, Chinese manufacturing sector already rebounded in March 2020 itself. China is often criticized for the unfair trade policies it maintains. Patent thefts, IPR violations, forced tech transfers, WTO violations, restricting foreign competition in domestic country and manip manipulating its own currency to maintain its dominance in the manufacturing sector and maintain the trade surplus. While US lawmakers were questioning the increased American dependence on China, citing the national security concerns, President Donald Trump has already ordered the US companies to relocate from China. The new data reveals that U.S. companies are indeed shifting from China. The implications on American manufacturing sector are unclear. Although there are a lot of other countries 
benefiting from this trade war. But one thing is for certain, the status quo is about to change. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know which are the other topics you want me to consider and please leave your valuable feedback.